What's up guys, how's it going? Mike the Tech here, and today I'm going to show you how to uh, fix an issue with Ryzen Master where it doesn't want to open and it says that the driver is not installed properly. Um, the thing is, the driver is installed properly, but it doesn't always clean up after itself when you update the app, and some registry keys um, were likely left behind, and that's why it's loading the wrong one. Uh, luckily, I found a post, um, let me bring it over here, by Squirty. And he has this really great fix, which I'm going to walk you through right now. So what you want to do to fix this is you go to uh, the start menu and you type regedit. And you're going to accept to run it as administrator. And then you're going to minimize all of this. We're going to go to H key local machine. Then you're going to go to system. Then you're going to go to control set zero. You're going to go to services, and then there's going to be um, the AMD Master Driver V19, V20, V18, whatever version you happen to have, and likely one right above it that's a lower number or without a number. Mine just said AMD Ryzen Master Driver, um, but yours may say AMD Master Driver V14 because that's the last one you used. Um, whatever it is, right click on that and just delete it only leave the newest one um, that you just installed. If you want to do it fresh, you could uninstall it completely and remove both and then reinstall it. But um, I feel like that's a bit extra. You could try this first and make sure it works. Um, just delete the older one and leave this one and then restart your computer. Once your computer restarts, you're going to open up the app just like you normally would and it's going to default to the new driver that was installed and it should work properly. Uh, but yeah, it's a pretty quick and easy process. Thanks again to Squirty for the solution. And uh, thank you so much for watching. Hope you have a great day. Peace. What? You've never heard of Stream Savers? And you thought PewDiePie was the only YouTuber to make a game? I made a game too. And it's called Stream Savers. And it's available for pre-order right now for $9.99. And that's a great price.